coming to the first set of questions that is question 26 to 30 in the di section of mock test 1 this set is basically about a person mr x who conducts the survey to find the number of cars in six major cities of india arguably this is the most easiest set in the whole di section we see the different column headings as less than one car, less than three cars, less than seven cars, more than two cars and more than four cars. What we will do, we will denote less than a, one car with a variable A, less than three cars with a variable B, less than seven cars with a variable C, more than two cars with a variable D and more than four cars with a variable E. Coming to the first question, that is question number 26. The question says, if the number of persons having at least eight cars in Kolkata is zero, then find the number of persons in Kolkata having exactly 7 cars. What does this question mean? This means that the maximum number of cars that a person can have in Kolkata is 7. When we go back to the table, we see that the value of A for Kolkata is 13, for B it is 31, C 47, D 21 and E is 14. We can say that the value of E is equal to the number of persons who have exactly 5 cars, 6 cars, and 7 cars. Similarly, the number of persons having more than 2 cars is equivalent to aggregate number of persons having exactly 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 cars. When we subtract E from D for Kolkata, we get that this is equal to 21 minus 14, that is equal to 7. This is nothing but the aggregate number of persons in Kolkata having exactly 3 cars and 4 cars. Let's denote this by a variable f. Now consider the column B. The data in the column B for the city Kolkata is 31. Now when I add B and F, that is 31 plus 7, we get 38. Now this 38 is equal to aggregate number of persons in Kolkata having exactly 0 cars, 1 car, 2 cars, 3 cars and 4 cars. So, in order to find the number of persons having exactly 5 cars and 6 cars, what we need to do, we need to subtract this 38 from 47. So, 47 minus 38 is equal to 9. And we already know that the number of persons in Kolkata having 5 cars, 6 cars and 7 cars is 14. And number of persons in Kolkata having 5 and 6 cars is 9. So, when we subtract 9 from 14, we get the aggregate number of persons in Kolkata 
that has exactly seven cars. So my option one is the correct choice. 